Hello Carvers, my name is Matt and I want to welcome you back. Uh, in the last video, we began working with the uh, CarveRight Design software. I started up for you and you got a chance to see what the uh, splash screen looked like. We uh, took a look at what the, some of the menus and what those had on them. And we also looked at, began to look at the toolbars and what each icon did and how to identify what those icons do and that sort of thing. I even uh, showed you how to get your first uh, project started and, and get that saved. So uh, I hope you've had an opportunity now to work with that software for a little bit and get comfortable with it, experiment, that sort of thing. So that what we do now in this video is more of a natural progression for you, okay? Now what I plan to do is I'm going to show you how to modify those different toolbars to your own liking and to your own needs, all right? So as you work with the software, you can come up with your own personal set of, of toolbars and uh, sort of like having your own little toolbox that you carry with you from job to job. So uh, let's go into the office, fire up that software, and get started. We need to learn something. All right, so we're going to fire up our CarWrite software here. And as you remember or recall, this is pretty much what we had last time. And I'm going to uh, go ahead and open up our last project. And so you can see this is our sample project. Now this is pretty much sure where we left off our last time together. And as you remember, we were looking at these various toolbars and trying to figure out what each one of these icons represented. And uh, we also looked at how to use the help assistant.